I'm thinking about growing the beard out. It's been a while. You can see it's trying to come in. Okay. I need to shave. I, my, my wife got me this real nice electric shaver. And all I got to do is keep my hair short enough so I can go over my head with it. And I just never do. I'm so lazy. But when I do shave, I'm going to try to keep the beard just to see how it works out. And I'm going to let Asia do a thing where it'll let it grow in thicker. And I still want to dye this. So we'll see how it goes. Um, <clears throat> nothing of consequence to report today. Just real chill day. Uh, sat down, I got some writing done, which was nice. Uh, it, man, I wish I could explain this to you. Like, since I started writing again, like, things just don't seem to stress me anymore. It's the strangest thing. It's like the difference between stress and no stress. Like, writing has always been an outlet for me. But writing this has been so much fun and introducing new characters and watching them interact. It's like, I wish I could, let me turn this off. I wish I could describe to you the feeling I get when I create some. See, here's the thing. I'll get up and I'll say, okay, I'm not going to force it today. I'm just not going to write and I'll sit down and I'll play my video game for a little while. And I'll do that till I get bored of it. Or I've just I've accomplished everything in the game that I want to do at this moment. So from there, I say, alright, well, let me sit down and see what I can do. So I sit down and then it just flows out of me. It just it just comes. It's it's the most amazing thing. Like there's almost a supernatural quality to it. And I know it sounds like I'm stretching. I'm not. There's just, there's a supernatural quality to it. These characters are alive to me. And all I really have to do is present them with a situation. And then it just takes shape on its own. Like, Ella's just so playful, you know? And Nathaniel's cold and funny and eager to please. Serenity is all about her business but loves her friends. Pascal is innocent but also very aware of things. Gar is very stern with himself. You know, he's simple minded. It's it's everything's black and white with him, good, bad, right, and wrong. Uh, KJ is stubborn with a bad attitude, but he has a good reason for having a bad attitude. Asia is like a glue that keeps them together and keeps everybody in line. It's, oh my God, I just, I sit and I start writing and it just, it, it just comes, man. It's. It's like nothing I've ever done before. And I don't worry so much about, oh, did I say this right? It, as you write it, it flows. It flows. Like Asia said this to me the other day, and my sister said this to me too, that when reading it, it's less them reading a story and more than they can see an episode being played out. Like, sometimes I feel like I'm not very descriptive. Sometimes I feel like I'm not descriptive enough. Or sometimes I feel like I'll rush through things. But then I go back and I look at it and it's just, it's written to be an easy read. It's written to flow nicely. You know, not a lot of big fancy words. His silhouette illuminated in the darkness as he came from the shadows and seeing ever so closely. Now it's just, he stepped through the front door. You know, it, it's all, it's insanely simple. And it shows. I think it really shows. And 
I'll be honest, it took me a long time to get out of the mindset of, you know, it had to be in a silhouette illuminated in the darkness and brought to light. It's, I, it took a long time for me to get away from that. And this, it's just simple and easy. And, oh my God, I'm, I'm having a blast. Where was this a year ago? Where was this two years ago when I needed it? I needed this. And it just wasn't here. But now it is. And it's just like, everything is just... I, I wish I could explain it to you. I really do. I mean, short of sitting here and just reading the whole damn thing to you, I can't explain it. But it's nice. It's real nice. And I don't know when it's going to be over. I'm going to be sad when it's over. You know, I'm, I'm going to have to find a way to keep it going somehow. You know, once like, the major threat has been eliminated, then what? Like, I need to find a way to keep these people around. And I'm not even going to stress about it. I'm not even going to worry about it. It's, it'll happen. It'll happen on its own. It'll happen organically. It'll happen naturally. Watch. It'll just, like, I was going through it today. Today, I wrote... The 13th episode in a series. I started this maybe two weeks ago. And there have been times when I've sat down and I'll write two or three at once. You know, but lately it's been one a day. And even that is more than anything I've ever done before. Just, it used to be like before I started this, even when I was working... And I bought a laptop specifically so I could work in the truck. It was like every now and then I would get a paragraph out. Because I was always being so meticulous to make sure that everything fit. And that everything was worded correctly. But this, it's just... It just flows, man. It's, it's, it's like nothing I've ever seen before. It's... I mean, you you know me. I don't. I I, I shy away from shit. Oh, it's just supernatural. But it just it has less to do with me than I really think I realize. And it's just more these characters just want to get out. These characters just want to be heard. And it's it's fantastic. It really is. I'm really, really enjoying myself with this. And I don't see it ending. Like, these videos are going to go on forever. I'll, I'll always do a video. As long as I'm able to hold the phone and I can upload it to YouTube. Like, my phone, for example, my phone's been off for a while. I haven't had service on my phone since I left my job in, like, June. But, you know, through texting apps and Wi-Fi, I can make calls and, you know... I connect to the Wi-Fi at home and I can do my thing. Like, as long as my phone exists, as long as I can connect to Wi-Fi anywhere, I'll always be doing these videos. And as long as I'm doing these videos and as long as there's breath in my body, I'll be writing. And if it's up to me, I'll always be writing this. So, we'll, we'll see how it goes. But it's definitely been a breath of fresh air in my life it's I've forgotten how much pressure I can alleviate by just sitting down and writing and I almost don't feel comfortable saying writing because I don't really feel like I'm writing anything it just comes it it just comes and it's a fantastic feeling. It really is. <sighs> All right. I'm, I'm done bragging about this work. I am. I just, just know that I have a piece about me that's really nice. It's just a piece. And I think it's because of writing. I think it's me allowing myself 
to let these characters out and to let them do their own thing is fantastic and it's calming. And as long as I continue to feel this way, I'll always be writing. And if it's up to me, I'll always be writing these characters. I can't imagine not at this point.